In this video by ABN Painting, we are spray painting both the trim and the body of the house. We already finished all preparation work, power washing, fixing cracks and holes, and now we are finishing up with masking. To prevent overspray getting on the roof, while we spray paint the trim, we used inch and a half tape that we applied to the inner part of the shingle. And then we ran another piece of tape and applied it to the side of the shingle. And we covered the area next to the edge of the roof with tarps. To spray paint the trim fascia, we reduce the pressure in the sprayer and we are using 411 flat tip, so the overspray is minimal. To spray paint the body of the house, we mask the trim with 12 inch masking paper, covered all the doors that we are not painting, the windows, uh, some furniture on the patio that was too heavy to move far away we covered with plastic. We covered the concrete right next to the house using 12 inch masking paper and then covered the rest of the area using tarps. On the front of the house we covered unpainted brick that we're not painting with 12 inch masking paper, put the tarps on a concrete next to the area that we spray and we're using 413 flat tip to spray paint the body of the house. Now this is how the body of the house looks like after two coats of paint. There's lines and streaks everywhere. Uh, this is because of the color. Uh, this color doesn't cover very well. So after we applied two coats, we had to apply the third coat of paint for the house to look nice. And this is how the house looks like before and after we finished. 